Many of you know of the WHS staff members as teachers, but little do you know of their fun side jobs and their interesting hobbies. Here's one story. Take a look. Okay, so I had a baby, and I love personalized items. So personalized clothing, like monograms and things like that. And so I started to want things for my daughter, but they're kind of expensive. So I'm pretty crafty. And I said, I could probably make this. And so my girlfriend in Virginia, who's also very crafty, uh, told me about this machine that she has. It's called a Silhouette Cameo. And it cuts. It's a cutting machine. So you can kind of think of it not like a printer, but instead of printing something, it cuts stuff. So it can like etch on metal or um, vinyl or even paper. And so what she does is she showed me how to cut vinyl and then you can iron it onto clothes. So I started to make personalized clothes for my baby. A lot of people in the social studies IMC and the business IMC had babies all at the same time. And so I wanted to give a gift, but nothing like, you know, too outrageous. And so I decided that I had some items for my own baby that I really liked that I had made and I thought they'd make really cute gifts for other babies. So I just made gifts for everybody and they really liked them and people had said, oh, you should sell those or do you have another one? Like I have a friend that had a baby, I'd love to give one. And so I just kind of said, okay, I can start selling this. That's what I did. So I put an item on the website and people will look at it. They, they make comments or like, like it, like you can on Facebook or favorite an item. And then if they want it, they buy it. And it all goes through like PayPal account. So I don't have to do anything with like the finance end of it. Um, and then it just sends me an email saying you have an order for this outfit and they'll tell me like the size and things of that nature. And then I make it and I ship it off. Well, I, I like making baby items because they're smaller and they're quicker to do. But for some reason, people have really liked um, personalized like tank tops like for working out or the raglan t-shirts, which are like the baseball kind of t-shirts that say sayings on it. So people will ask for like customized sayings or I have some that I've already made and people will buy those. So I do a lot of custom orders. So people will email me and say, hey, I'm thinking about this. Can you make me this design? And then I'll create something for them and they approve it and then I make it. My husband at nighttime takes online classes. So when he gets home from work, we hang out for a little bit and he take, we, eat, we eat dinner together. And then we kind of put the baby down to sleep and then he does schoolwork. So I didn't really have anything else going on. Um, so I like being able to have my own thing on the side that is creative for me. And I'm not getting in my husband's way while he's trying to do schoolwork. So it's kind of fun, it gives me something to do. Um, growing up, my mom and dad did craft shows. They made like wood items and painted it. Um, so I've been aware of it, but I've never done one myself. I think the craft show was really good. I didn't do as well as I would have hoped, but the fair itself was really nice. And I think it had a good turnout for the school. I haven't really made that many things for me. It's been for everybody else, but I make like the tumblers. So I really like my monogram on stuff. Um, I mostly make things for my daughter, which I really like. So for like holidays is really fun because like President's Day is not really a holiday that a lot of people celebrate. So I made her a shirt that said Lincoln is my homeboy and it had Lincoln's face on it. So I think things like that are really fun because I love history and I want to have my daughter have some sort of history background. But it's not something I can go buy in the store because nobody else really celebrates President's Day. So I like making things like that or um, I just got these really big elephants in, like these huge, big stuffed animal elephants that I can't buy in the stores. And I'm gonna put um, her name on the ears. So I think like that's really cute. So I really like doing things that I can't find in the stores. I think it's fun. I really like having the creative outlet, like I said, because I think it's hard to come to work all day and then go home and, and not have anything else to do. Like I don't want to just sit around and watch TV all day. So I think it's really nice to have that extra hobby. So I would highly encourage other people to find something they like to do and actually go do it. Not just think about it or say, oh, I don't have anything I like. Find something you like and go do it because it's going to make your day and your life more exciting. From WTV, this has been Lily.